Ruby, who I had read for another project a couple years back, is just such a unique individual. She's beautiful, she's tough, she's feminine, she's masculine. She's just embodied everything. We have Adele, who's kind of this sniper, and we meet her. And from her, we kind of built this relationship that she has with Xander. You know, no one has his number. So what are you up to these days? Me? No! I'm evening the odds. One of the most fun scenes that I got to write is this idea of a sniper kind of out in the Serengeti. And it looks at first like she's hunting a lion, but then it turns out that she's hunting the poachers. When I read that in the first couple pages of the script, I, w I just fell in love. I was like, I have to play this character. I kid you not, from the very first phone call I made to her, I had her out in the range maybe six hours after she had the job. She was committed to being a great sniper, and she is. I mean, she was like, you know, for a thousand yards away, putting a bullet through playing cards. She just became, you know, not so much obsessed, like, I'm gonna be the best sniper ever, but she just wanted everything that she did with the gun to be that. I would rather if you didn't... Oh. <laughs> it's refreshing. You actually know what you're doing down there. Yeah, that's what she said. <laughs> What I love is that none of these people have superpowers, but they have this superhero aspect. You know, like uh, my character can climb up a tree, but that's something that is physically possible with this silk rope. Not everyone can do it, but if you train hard enough, you can. It's a learnt skill that they have, and it's something unique and special about them, but it's not otherworldly.